going live a little earlier than normal just because I've been paying attention to the comments and a lot of people are bummed to be missing my lives because I do them so late. So, right now we're doing an early live. I might do a live back at my normal time because it's a lot of fun later when I'm painting as well. So, yes, for all of you who may go to school tomorrow or work early tomorrow, I'm here early just for you guys. What is going on? It's Wednesday. Wait, is it Wednesday? Yes, it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Awesome. We're almost to Friday. Every day's a Friday for me though, for the most part. So today I have my makeup done. Finally, can you say finally? You have your makeup done, Stephanie. That is so awesome. So, let's see. Um, the lives have been a lot of fun. No worries if you can't stay and you're busy, that's fine. I just wanted to come on early today because, like I said, a lot of people are bummed that I come on so late. But I will be doing a live later tonight as well. Um, because, you know, just work, 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 work. But, um, let's see. It is, you know, I need to get that clock to go right here in the back of me. What time is it before everybody starts asking? It's 3.30 p.m. in California. I was just on eBay still looking for the for a kit that grabs me. Thank you to you and Jackie. I just put up another baby on eBay today. So I've got a few babies up on eBay. Um, hopefully, but yeah, maybe by the end of the weekend I'll have some more babies up. So let me turn down the uh, fan because it is blowing in my eyes again. All right, okay. So yeah, I just put another doll on eBay. How do you go live? It's just a button in your um, YouTube. When you go to record a video or you can go live. So you just pick the go live option. So, oh, awesome for finding a Love of Bella doll. Those have been kind of hard to find, it seems. I'm glad that you found one. Yeah, it's pretty early all around the United States. That's, you know, I'm here earlier than normal, so a lot of people aren't expecting that. But I will be doing my regular live later on tonight. So, yeah. Can't find the Love of Bellas in the Bermuda? Uh -huh. you Will they eventually be coming out over there? That would hopefully be... Um, you don't have toy stores? Well, that really kind of sucks. I guess you can get them on eBay, right? If you can't get them in your local state or, you know, in your country, you could probably get them on eBay. They are selling them on eBay. I've been checking them out to see, like, what kind of crazy prices they have them for on eBay. Because usually, you know, on eBay, it's like, they have them for really high prices. I'm doing good. Um, surprise I'm up and running. I went to bed late, like really late, and got up early, like really early. I don't know, I just couldn't sleep. So I'm painting several kits, as always, several of the same ones from last night. Um, I've been working a lot on the Emma by Natalie Scholl over here. It's cute. No, you know what? I didn't get that uh, unicorn head because it wasn't worth $30. I felt like the quality was just not there. So I'm like, I'm not going to buy this. So I've been working on the um, Emma Scholl today. And then over here is our other kits we're working on. Don't mind that little headless doll over there. But um, there's the other ones we're going to be working on. So... Right now, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do next on this baby. I'm at a point where I really have to think because we're on the downhill side of painting. Like, she's gonna be done very soon. She's coming along really nice. So I'm enjoying this doll a lot. Um, I don't like to paint a lot during the day because it's really like, I get like a golden, golden sunlight from that window. But, with the right setting, I could find what I'm going to need. I'm actually thinking she might need like a pink layer as 
what I'm kind of thinking with this one. She's still pretty pale for what I'm looking for, but um, I think I'm probably gonna do like this pink wash on her, which I will thin down a little bit. And this is the thinner that I use, is Mona Lisa. You can get this at Michael's. That's where I get it, at Michael's. And if you use the Michael's coupon, you can get like 40% off on it. So, yeah. So let's just try this pink layer on this doll. I wanna see what it's gonna do for me. She's, we're building with the tone to try to finish up where I'm going with this. Um, so, I don't know. I'm just taking my time with this one, really. Uh, to the doll show, I really would like to take 20 dolls. I really would. And I'm pretty sure it will be possible. How many did I take last year? Like 16. I think I took 16 last year. And last year's doll show was like... Um, really last minute planning for myself. Uh, yes, I do know who Tiny Creations by Kim is. It's in Layton, Utah. Layton, Utah is a doll show. So, yeah. I'm hoping to have this doll done soon. I'm really curious about, I don't know, part of me wants to keep this doll in my collection. But lately when I keep it in my collection, I feel so bad. Because I'm like, you really could be selling that doll for bill money or something important. But we'll see. If I'm bonded to this doll, I'll definitely keep it for at least a little bit, right? I uh, know I don't talk to Nadia anymore. I don't really know what happened to Nadia. She kind of just like disappeared. So the last time you guys saw her is the last time I saw her actually. <laughs> Warning these dolls are not real kids. They're fake babies. Yes, they are fake babies. So what do we have going on up here? You love my shirt? It's the Molly shirt. One of the Mollies. Let's see. <laughs> Thank you, Reborn Mama 2017. Yes, uh, the live chats are not a place to be begging for um, free dolls. I mean, it's not good to be begging for free dolls in general. I have noticed in the live chats that a lot of people watching these live chats get slightly irritated with people begging for free dolls. And I don't even have to get irritated. It's everybody else gets pretty bothered by it. So all I can say is if you can't afford the dolls just to save your money and one day you'll get one or, um, you know, find a doll that is something that you can budget for. You know, everybody has to work for what they want. Um, unfortunately, that's just the way... Life is, nothing is free, you know. It's always, for your whole life, you're going to work for everything you want. Even in school, you know, you have to, like, just grade school, high school, you have to work for your age, you know. They're just not handed to you. So, um, you know, keep that in mind, that you just can't walk into Walmart and ask them to give away, you know, what's being sold on the shelves for free. You have to pay for everything. So, let's not upset everybody in the chat by asking for free dolls. Yeah, my first doll I ever sold, it sold for like between $70 and $80 on eBay. It just bid. I let it bid. In fact, you know, you just, when you first start, you kind of got to let dolls bid. Um, you know, you're learning. When you're learning, I we didn't really set prices on stuff just because in our thinking was, we're learning it's not our perfected talent so we're not gonna set a price on it to sell um, kind of just gonna let it bid and do its own thing so that's how that went oh I'm so glad Mayberry babies reborns you made it to live chat yeah I'm doing live chat early because I saw a lot of comments that people were kind of bummed that they're always missing it so that just means I'll do one later tonight for everybody else there's a lot of people that enjoy the late night chats because um, 
you know, they've put their kids to bed and it's kind of just their, their time to relax and hang out. So they're really having a blast with the live chats. So I'm kind of like trying to compromise here and, you know, make one early here and there. How does it feel to have so many fans? Um, I, don't, I mean, I just see you guys as friends. I think it's great that I have so many people, I lost my soda, that I have so many people interested in watching my channel. I just really appreciate that because, you know, without you guys, I wouldn't have a channel and it's just, it means a lot to me. So I just consider this just hanging out and, um, you know, pretty much it. How did Tambry respond to Jackie and I first getting together? She was like kind of slightly jealous because she didn't want anybody to take their mom away, just like anything else. You know, when your mom gets a new boyfriend or girlfriend or whatever, you fear that your mom will lose attention in you because we focus on what's new in your life. So it went really well, actually, after she realized that she wasn't gonna be left out we always include Tambri in everything that we do. Um, we rarely do just like Jackie and I things because we don't want Tambri to ever feel left out. But now she's getting older that she doesn't want to do anything with us sometimes. However, we are going to a comedy show in October, just Jackie and I, because, you know, the comedy shows are more, they're geared towards adults. I don't even know if there's kids allowed to them, actually. But, yeah, so it went over really well. Let's see. Do you have any babies selling? I could, yes, I, I do have babies for sale. Um, on eBay. If any of my lovely followers or moderators have the link to my eBay channel, could you guys please post that up um, in the comment box? It's not easy for me to do because I'm on my phone. And um, I can go on the laptop and try to do it. But yeah, I do have some for sale. Maybe somebody will share the link to my eBay channel. We'll see. A lot of people do share it once I ask. I just kind of got to wait. Okay. Um, repeat it again. It's, let's see. It's uh, In Love With Reborns 2011 dash Heart to Heart Babies is my eBay name. Let me see if I can get the link. I have to, I don't think any of my moderators are on here. Give me a second. I'm gonna grab the laptop because I think all of my moderators are not aware of the fact that I'm actually um, live so early. Oh, uh, you know what? Why is there ugly stuff coming up? No, um, they're wanting to... I can't get you the link. Because I'm not signed into it on Jackie's laptop. And <laughs> to be honest, I don't know if I know the password. <laughs> Which is like really horrible. Let me see if I can switch accounts. Let me see if it'll come up over here. Yeah, it's uh, in love. No I-N. It's just a letter in. Let me see if it comes up on Jackie's laptop. Oh, hold on. I think, I think I'll be able to get in here. Give me one second, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying, guys. Okay, cool, I got into it. So, I'm just gonna go grab an auction link that I have going here. Man, have you guys noticed that eBay has changed some things? I do not like the setting that they did. It's ridiculous. It won't let you post a link? That's so weird. And moderators can post links. Let me see if I can post a link. If I have to go sign into my YouTube over here. Give me one second. I'm trying. Oh my gosh. This laptop is really being a pain. This laptop's going crazy. So see, here's, here's one of the dolls. Okay, so. No, I don't do Etsy. I mean, uh, Etsy, the reason... I know people don't like eBay, but I'm gonna tell you what. The reason I will only ever sell on eBay is because eBay has a huge, a much larger buying uh, platform than any other selling site. 
So I know like people have created places to sell dolls. I even like promote myself on um, Facebook and all these different pages. But where I sell, um, trying to find my live feed here on YouTube. Where I sell most of my dolls, to be honest, is on eBay. It's, um, why can't I see it? I'm in my, I'm in here. It's on eBay. It's just a, a way larger selling platform. So, it's just the way to go. Etsy, they just sit there. Do you want me to try to figure it out for you? Um, yeah, if you want to. I don't see the live right here. See, I'm in my live, but I don't see it. I'll do it for you. Go, go and keep doing what you're doing. Go and keep doing what you're doing, girl. Oh, I'm just here chatting away. Now we have bad connection. It's just lovely. Just lovely. Let's see. I'm in your life. You're in my life? Cool. Yeah. Can you just share, like, an auction link? Sure. Okay. Jackie's going to share some auction link. Yeah, I see... I saw the new site, babybugsboo.com. Um, I think it's a really cool concept. I've tried to maneuver through there. It doesn't work so easily for me. And then also, once again, the selling platform is very small. Super small. It's, it's just, you know, eBay reaches out to hundreds of thousands of people, right? So... I don't always necessarily sell my dolls to people who are collectors um, because when they're on eBay, they can sell to whoever and whatever is on there. Um, that's the thing. eBay puts you out there in a broader spectrum to sell on and that's why I sell on eBay. I've tried, you know, Dollfan and everything else and I've tried Etsy actually. I had auctions on Etsy. And they just never did anything because the selling platform is so small. Um, until someone can create something that just outshines eBay, that's where I will sell. I just don't have time to deal with the smaller guys, I should say, because there's not enough people on there. eBay is just, it's huge, guys. If you're going to sell, and I'll honestly, you're going to sell on eBay. The thing when you get with like forums and stuff, in forums and and that new doll site that's out it's just the same group of people so it's the same group of people you don't have new traffic coming in it's my fingers are pink in ebay you have the doll people and then you have new people coming in so you know dolls are always going to sell on ebay and then to be honest i have been selling on ebay for six years and out of my whole six years i've had three bad incidents um two were this past year but you know what it ended up working out i ended up getting my money and selling the doll you know i ended up it ended up working out i didn't get scammed and then the other incident was like three years ago so yeah i have a pretty good time with ebay the last two non-paying bidders I had, um, I just canceled the sale and I resold again and they sold better. So, you know, didn't hurt nothing. So, yeah, that's why I sell on eBay. I know, I'm sorry. I really do try my best. <laughs> but it, it, just with the time it takes going into setting up auctions and stuff and joining these new sites and putting them up there. Like, I used to always put my stuff on Dollfan, and it just would never sell. And I'm like, man, it takes time to put my information here on Dollfan. Upload my photos. For it to just sit there, and then it sells on eBay. So, and yet 90% of my sales are to strangers. It's pretty funny. I have no idea who most of them are. So, it works out. A lot of people don't like eBay, but it's really where you got to sell on eBay. Yeah, see, Swift Swimmer, I've had dolls, like, post them up on Instagram or Facebook for a few days and nobody does anything, and then you put them on eBay, and matter of time, they just, they sell really fast. Like, I can have dolls, they'll usually, sometimes they'll sit on eBay for a couple weeks if it's the slow selling season, 
But if it's like the hot season with dolls, because you do go through slow and hot seasons with dolls, they'll sell really fast. Um, uh, Bex Anthony, I mean, thank you for wanting to sell me a doll. But when I buy dolls, it's definitely got to be something I'm interested in. Um, so when you have dolls to sell you, and you have something posted, I'll check it out. I sold a Chucky doll on eBay listed for 47 That's awesome. Wow. That's like a $4,700? Dang. Was it like an original Chucky doll? Because that's like, like from the movies? Because that's a lot of money for a Chucky doll. That's crazy. Or like the first editions of Chucky dolls. Um... I get my kits. I get a lot of kits from Bountiful Baby, Irresistibles, Doll Nursery. My favorite Disney character. Disney princess would be uh, Ariel and Belle. And now, like, character. Let's think of a plushy character. Um, I always liked Winnie the Pooh. Piglet and, t and Tigger when I was younger. Oh. Hmm. But yeah. No, I don't have a website. Just eBay. eBay. You know, I don't need a website. <laughs> With eBay, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube, I do not need any eBay, any um, ins uh, websites, actually. Thank you to social media. I feel like websites will eventually die down because it's like you don't need them anymore. But at least that's how it is for myself. <coughs> okay, so. What? Oh my gosh. Are you still in my life? Yeah. Give me one second, guys. Okay, so if you'd like to learn how to paint, if you could find the tutorial Precious Little Baby by Precious Little Baby Desk, it's really good. That's a really good tutorial. I like those ones. They're about, um, I blocked them. They were like 60, I think, I know, like 50 bucks, but it's worth it. It's a really good tutorial. So here we are with this one. You can't really see what I can see because the camera quality is not my nice camera quality. Because when you go live, you're kind of limited. But she has got a more pink skin tone. Like, see, compared to my arm, uh, it's really hard to show you guys. But she's got a more newborn skin tone. So right now, I'm going to leave her as is. And then we're going to go on to... Um, another doll. So I'm going to move this baby out of here and grab a different baby. And grab a different baby. It's so weird to be doing this uh, live during the day because I'm used to doing it at night time. I feel like it's a totally different, it's totally, it's all kinds of different people actually. These are like new people that I've seen in here during the day. That kit was Emma by Natalie Scholl. She's a sold out kit, so you can no longer get her. So I'm gonna move on to, I think we're gonna go into Kelly Maple's doll. Um, I've got Kelly Maple's doll to the warming tones that I want to take it to the next level. So Kelly wanted her doll to look like um, my Alex that I had, if you guys remember Alex. So she wanted it to look like him, or similar. So that's what we're working to. I have to, what I'm gonna do now is, Alex had 
a slightly um, a light ethnic tone. So I've got the nice warming colors for underneath the tone and I'm looking for my ethnic paint and I want to say Jackie might have taken it and changed its color. So that is not where I want to be. All right. What? Nothing. You edited our ethnic painting color. <laughs> oh, I like it. I know you like it, but it's nothing that I paint with. It's not edited. Well, you added to it to change it. Are you going to change it now? Well, I can't change it. You've already changed it. I can't go back to what it was. Okay, I'm going to work with this color that Jackie made, which usually is a fell for me. We'll try it. We'll see. If not, I'm going to have to make my own color. I did have my own color until she added to it. I told her that she's going to change my ethnic skin tone to get a new container. She never listened. Never. She's a bad girl. Why am I always on the phone when I'm watching videos? I don't know. Well, do you watch the videos? Oh, on phone call? I don't know. I don't really get phone calls. All right, cool. So we're going to see how this goes. We're going to do a couple layers of this darker tone just to give him... Alex had like a Hispanic tone, Italian tone kind of thing. So that's where I'm working with on this doll. And it's painting nice. So I'm probably going to do two layers of this skin. And then um, I will go into using some yellows. Uh, I wouldn't bake in my personal oven. I don't bake in my personal oven. I bake in a new wave. You just can't trust these vinyls 100%. I mean, I, they do put off an odor. I can't say whether it's safe or not. Baking the vinyls hasn't been along really long enough to say if, you know, longevity of breathing them is safe or not. It's better to be safe than sorry, right? So we bake in New Wave ovens outside. Where we have good ventilation and we're not around them when they're baking. So that's what I recommend. I'm not saying baking in your personal oven is right or wrong. I'm just saying I don't want to risk my lungs or anything else like that so we like to be safe versus regretting it later but yeah so gonna be hopefully getting this guy's done soon um, I don't know if she's gonna pay to have him rooted or get painted hair we haven't talked about that this far so we shall see I think we'll figure that out when this baby's done. She's making it a girl, actually, so it's going to be a girl version of Alex. Be very cute. I mean, as close as I can make it, a girl version. I can't really replicate my work. I can get very close. Sometimes I do replicate it. It's crazy because I haven't seen that work in a long time. And then I make it look just like that doll. It's crazy how it works out. So... This color is working for me for now. Yeah, I think two layers of this color and we'll be good to go. You need to see more of London and Paris? I can make that happen. I was thinking that yesterday that I needed to do a video with them. I don't really do much with them because, you know, them being the clay, they are very sensitive. So I'm trying to keep them without cracking or anything. And so far, my babies have no cracks. I just take really good care of them so they don't crack or anything and that's how I want to keep it uh clay dolls are not really meant to be handled so much you know if you drop those babies and they're gonna be that's it it's the end of their days I would be so sad if I broke them but yes I need to find a cute outfit to put them in for a while I um change them and I leave them in that outfit until the next video because like I said I don't do a lot of hands on with them but they are so cute find a cute um maybe I'll find a cute like Halloween outfit for them that they can wear through Halloween it's almost like they get changed once a month or once every two months but that's what happens when you're such a delicate baby so I'll definitely make a video with them soon. As soon as I find something to put them in. Which is some cute Halloween stuff out. 
Actually, I might have something Halloween for them to wear. Two, I can put them in. Okay, so we are just about done with layer one of this ethnic baby. Well, it's not an ethnic baby. Ethnic skin tone that I'm applying to get the look that I want. Now we'll start working with details. You guys can really looks like pretty bad when you when I show it on the camera to you guys. Boy. In person it looks way different. Okay. So uh how much I think she sells those dolls. They start at a thousand dollars. Um London and Paris were made for me as a special she wanted me to share them on my channel to help get her work out in the public eye. So she created the dolls for me. I paid for the materials. I don't know if I paid for shipping. I can't remember. But so, um, but I believe that they do start at $1,000 now. And they're so worth it. So worth it. And they're... Uh, that will be a silicone kit release. Not of London and Paris, but it's going to be a two-headed baby. I'll be making the prototype for one of those. So that's going to be super exciting. Super exciting. I don't know if I'll be keeping it or if I will be um, selling it. Not sure. I don't have reborns that crack, so I'm not really sure about that. Are you going to do anything special for your reborns for Halloween? No. I don't really do anything special. Maybe just make a Halloween video. I don't know what, what our plans are, but um, we don't really have anything special planned so far. So maybe I could do like, and Tambry's past that trick or treating age. So I used to, when Tambry was younger, we would do a trick or treating video and take a doll out with us. But now she doesn't really do that. So, I wanted to be alerted, but it came back because I thought you missed. We weren't alerted. I'm sorry. I'm going to be back later tonight, too, so don't stress. Check your alert notifications to make sure it tells you. I don't know. Some people it tells you right away, and then some people it doesn't. I don't know why it does that. That's awful. There's nothing worse than waiting for something and you don't get the notification on it. That would totally suck. Okay. Well, hello from Turkey. All right. We're almost to the point where I'm going to be baking this baby and then seeing how the tone is. And I think we're going to go with some yellows next. Get the skin tone I'm looking for. Hopefully that is the answer to what I need. Ah, just gotta do one more layer on the head. One more layer on the head. Beautiful little reborn says, practice, practice, practice. Practice, practice, practice. That's all you have to do. Every day I'm practicing. Every day I'm practicing. Every day I'm practicing. I never stop learning. I always change my style to find what I really like and then I change it again. It's just practice, practice, practice. Hi, did you sneak in? And then you sneaked out. And then you sneaked in. And then you sneaked out. Reborn Daddy said hi. <laughs> He's such a dork. You're in a good mood today, huh? Hmm? Well, I'm actually very sleepy. I know. I'm <laughs> you, you woke us up way too early. I know. We went to bed super late. I'm about to have another energy drink. No, those are so bad. You are so bad. I'm about to get my bang on with my energy drink. Because that's what it's called. Who dances around with the reborn doll heads? I do, I do, I do, I do. Everyone say, hi, Jackie. Hi, Jackie. Jackie is a little wacky. Okay. Alrighty. Jackie, I need you to start baking my kids, man. Tell Tambry. Tambry is... She is no help, that child. 
No help. I don't drink monsters. Here. I drink this. Bang, bang. This is what I have. I don't know if I'll have another one, but this is just what I drink. Not every day. Bang, bang. Here you go. Oh, I thought you wanted No, it. I'm not having it right now. I don't want to have it in public where everybody can watch me. It's not. And like, judge me. I already know I had one of them. <laughs> My dad built those drying racks over there. Aren't they pretty cool? I, th I don't know if it's healthy. I get it at a GMC store. They sell like, like vitamins and stuff. I would think maybe it's a little more healthy than some of the other things that you can buy. Let's see. Oh my gosh, I wish I had more energy. I, uh, I don't know, what, what time we go to bed? One? And then we were up at six? Whoa, I'm about to fall down. What? Get crazy with it. Get jiggy with it. Nah, 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 nah. What are you looking at, Tambri? What? Oh my gosh. Been practicing with Tambri driving, although she has a while before she can even drive. And she's driving me crazy. She wants to go driving because she wants to make a video. So you know what that means. I have to end this live chat so we can go driving. But I'm using the card. Oh. Isn't there like three? But I don't know what's going on right now. <laughs> All right, guys. Yeah, she's growing up so fast. It's what they do. You get them food and water, they grow. Like little weeds. Just, they just grow up so fast. All right, well, I'm going to cut out for this one. We will be back later tonight for sure. I'll probably have more energy because maybe I'll secretly drink that energy drink where nobody can judge me. Um, <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thanks so much for watching, and hopefully you'll be able to join in later.